Hello YouTube, welcome to a new Scene Anatomy video. Today I want to demonstrate how you can transform a piano loop with a sampler and a new scene mode in a sequence. For the beginning we need a piano sample. Let's hear it first. To create a piano slice instrument, you must go to the sampler slice mode. I use here the auto slicer and split the sample in 8 slices. To get a better view on your sample, you can press the edit button to get access to the big sample screen. Here you have a better insight and you can zoom in and out. I will process now each slide with a fade out for better and proper sound. Just press process and fade out for each slice, so you can process each slide individually. Then I will export and save each slice to one pad. Press save and slice two pads. I will add now an envelope to each slice with a bit of attack for a better starting point of the sound. Now we have our piano slicer instrument ready for the new scene mode. Beside the song mode you can find now this scene mode. If you are familiar with programs like Ableton Live or Bitwig, this area will make you happy because it operates in the same way. You have here different scenes and you can add them with a the plus button. To add now a pattern to bank A in scene 1, press on it, then a menu opens where you can create a pattern. Create a new pattern and drag the empty pattern in your desired place. Like in Ableton or Bitwig, press on it and it starts. Switching now to the pattern sequencer where you can enter your steps. Let's enter some steps of our piano instrument. You can stop your patterns on the right side in the screen overview. If you want to add one more scene to your track, you just press the plus button and again create a new pattern. Honestly, I'm not the biggest fan how you can enter the steps, what you can see also on the video.
Beatmaker includes also a new design mixer where you can see all individual instruments. For example, if you want to adjust the volume of one slice from bank A, just press on bank A and the mixer unfold. Now you have full access to each individual slice volume. Another cool feature is that you can paste directly the scenes in your song. For this feature, the button Paste Song is on the button. To start with this feature, go back to the beginning of your song, select your desired pattern and paste it to the song. In the song mode, you can see now that the pattern is now pasted in the track A of your song. Back on the scene mode, if you want to add another bank of instruments to your track, a bank B per example, the song and scene mode adds automatically this new bank to your page. As mentioned already, with the plus button you can add scenes as much as you want. Inside the pattern sequencer you can enter your steps, but also it includes a full piano roll. You can also zoom in the sequencer in and out to get a better overview which steps or notes you play. I hope you received a short overview how easy you can create a piano instrument from a simple sample and how you can use this in the scene mode inside the new version of Beatmaker. If you have questions, please leave them in comments below. I will try to answer them as soon as possible. And as usual, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a positive thumb and a subscription for more future videos. Big thanks for watching and for your continued support. I hope to see you again in one of my next videos. Bye!